What's up guys, Charlie here from techinform.us. So I'm here with another Minecraft tutorial showing you how to install the Essentials plugin on a bucket server. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do, you're going to go to this link. This link can be found by going to bucket.org. And then going over here to bucket dev, server mods, just search Essentials. Go to projects only, search, and then here it is, essentials. So what you're going to do, you're going to download this mod by clicking the download button. And then as you can see, it is, it work, they've updated it for 1.2.5. So if you don't, if your server is not on 1.2.5, check out my video on how to update a server. Then go to download. You should download pretty quickly. Next, you're just going to find your server file, your server folder, here it is, and you're going to go into the plugins folder, and now what you're going to do, you're going to uh, drag this to the desktop and open it up, then you're just going to take all of these, copy them by hitting command C or control C, then paste them using control V or command V, and now what you're basically just going to do, you're going to start up your server. Now it should give you a lot of warnings at first because it's um, creating a lot of the folders and everything. There we go, it's creating all these files. Here we go. Now we're just going to go ahead and stop it by clicking stop. Just stop our server. Now as you can see in your plugins folder, it would have made two essential folders. So you can go in there and you can open up the configuration files. And you can go ahead and configure your essentials any way you want to. And then you also have the configuration um, metrics where you can opt out to try to connect, to try to have your server connect to metrics.griefcraft.com. Uh, I'm just going to type in true to opt out and then just save it. Now what you're going to want to do, to be able to use essentials you're going to have to be op, so go to the ops.txt and type in your username. And now just save it. And now you can go ahead and start up your server again. Now while that's starting up, you're going to go ahead and open up Minecraft. Wait for that to load up. Now I'm going to go ahead and actually change my options to make it easier for um, the screen recording. Now when the server's done, you're going to go ahead and go to multiplayer, join your server. Now you should hit T, you can go to slash PM, then you have all the essential mods. Now we'll be doing a tutorial on how to do this, um, but that is the basics of installing essentials. So again, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.